and welcome back to the channel for everyone that's new my name is hannah i love all things disney lounge fly star wars harry potter and today i have two lounge fly one of them is one that arrived a couple days ago and the other one is a mystery box haven't done a mystery box lounge fly for a couple of months now because i've not had the best luck with them i've never got one of the grails or one that i was like oh my goodness but every now and again you gotta just have a go so the first one which like i said arrived a couple days ago is the Disney Wish lounge fly backpack. Now, Disney Wish is the newest cruise line, cruise ship for Disney Cruise Line, which debuts, set sail, maiden voyage, whatever you want to call it, next year in 2022. Now, the other cruise lounge fly that I have, the kind of teal and the navy blue, they just say Disney Cruise Line on the badge, whereas this one is specific to the Disney Wish. And this is a placement backpack, so different ones will have different placements. I think I got really lucky because I got Captain Mickey right on the front pocket just there. I did notice though, the cruise ship itself is upside down. Now, I don't think that's supposed to be upside down, but it's just the all over print design. So this was actually exclusive to Amazon. I've never seen them have an exclusive lounge fly before. Well, not that I've seen anyway. And when did this get released? This was released for pre-order on October the 22nd and I remember that because we had just come back from the Harry Potter studio tour down in London and somebody had tagged me in a post saying that Amazon had got the, this lounge fly up for pre-order and I thought this is beautiful because me and my husband did go on one of the UK staycation cruises in September on the Disney Magic and we're hooked it was our first ever cruise and we're hooked so we've said we would like our next one to be on the wish if possible maybe next year we're going back to Walt Disney World and hopefully in 2023 we might be able to get on the wish so I've got my backpack ready but it's so pretty and this bow it's like not felt what's the word I'm looking for velvet velvet kind of navy blue bow which is really pretty and the ears let me take this bit off actually just protects the ears look a paddingy Thing. a little bit bent but that's not too bad but yeah like i said i got really lucky with captain mickey on the front have donald pluto captain minnie as well so i think i got quite lucky with the placement on mine if i do a 360 isn't it pretty i'll show you the back as well because you can see more of the print on there it's got the disney cruise line logo as well and I think that is meant to be the wish that comes out, which will be the largest so far of the cruise ships. But it's so beautiful. And I love how it's got kind of the navy blue and the gold accents everywhere. It's so pretty. So we'll open it up. I have no idea what the lining is. I haven't checked that out yet. What was the cost? I want to guess at about $80, but I'll pop the cost up just there. I can't actually remember. Uh, view the noisy part. I do package these tightly, which is good, I suppose. I do put the packaging back in, just so they keep the shape. There's another one. Okay, what is this lining? If I can move that, that might be a bit easier to see. So it's like a navy blue with red details, like the, the symbols that are on the front, but kind of in red. Hopefully you can see that. And just nice and navy blue. Very, very pretty. Is Daisy on this? So we found Captain Mickey on the front. We have Captain Minnie on the front. We've got Goofy with some ice cream just there. We have Donald and Pluto. Is there anybody else? Let's check the pockets. I don't think, oh, oh, hold on. Did I just see Chip and Dale? Oh, I appear to have a Chip and Dale right there. Looks like they're going on a ride. I don't think Daisy's on here. Sorry, Daisy. But I can only see those other ones. And the bottom is just navy blue to match the rest. So next is the mystery. And I'm really, really nervous. Although, what would be quite funny, that Wish Cruise Line lounge fly was one of the options as one of the Grail backpacks. Now, I'm, I've never had one of the Grail backpacks in these mystery boxes, 
but it would be typical that I get a duplicate of that wish one that's just arrived because I pre-ordered that from Amazon. The only plus with that is I would get to pick my placement, which would be lovely. But I think with this one, and again, I'll link the exact listing down below. I think it was kind of 50-50. Like half of them, I was like, please, no, and half I was like, oh, yeah, please. Oh, I'm nervous. There's paper on the top, so I can't see. Okay. Okay. You are kidding me. <laughs> um, okay. I have one of the Grail Lounge Fly Backpacks. It's... Oh, goodness. Now, it's not that wish one. But it is... Teal sequin cruise line lounge fly, which was one of the Grail backpacks. Now you can see my dilemma. <laughs> You're not seeing double. How? This is quite funny actually. The one time I get one of the Grail lounge fly backpacks, and I've got it. Although saying that, right, let me get it out. Give me a moment. Excuse the noise. Slow. Oh my giddy on. Oh! Good fuck! <laughs> Do you know what? I'm almost a bit speechless. But how typical is that though? The first time that I get one of the Grail ones and it's one that I have. I'm not going to move that because I've got a festive present placed right in front of it that knowing me will just fall if I move it. I tried to do Christmas behind me. I'm slight sidetracked. I did put some lights up as well, but when I did a quick test recording, the lights were flickering. Even though they were just on, they were flickering on the video, so I did take them down. So I was a bit more festive, but I don't want to send people off. A bit weird. Now, <laughs> I'm kind of speechless, to be honest. The only difference, which would possibly make me want to keep this one over that one, is this one has the blue Mickey at the top just there, whereas mine doesn't have that one anymore. No idea how the blue Mickey came out of mine, so I was really careful. I was really delicate, but it came off. So, no idea what happened there. So if you've seen my videos before, you will have seen me show this backpack. I will just show it for anyone that is new. And again, please do consider liking and subscribing, just in case you've not seen this one before. So it's the new teal cruise see what i mean actually disney cruise i was saying that i just earlier with the wish one disney cruise line says right there whereas that other one says disney wish i feel like i should have worn a cruise jersey today in my cruise ears <laughs> oh dear me anyway i'm getting sidetracked because i'm kind of speechless and a bit in shock that i've finally got one of the grey ones anyway teal blue sequins so we shall do a 360 Nice and plain on the back and on the bottom. I don't actually remember the lining for this one. So we'll find out together. But I can't remember. Oh, come on. Goodness. No. Oh. Do I do another Mr. Lounge fly soon? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, it's just teal blue. I've forgotten. Probably because it's not that memorable. Not boring, but just kind of a little bit basic. Just a nice teal blue colour. I have done a couple of the Spirit Jersey mystery boxes, would you call those ones? Listings. And I've never had one of those grails either. I tend to get either... I've had duplicates of the hooded one, the olive Spirit Jersey. I'll pop some pictures up just in case you're bothered. The tie-dye jerseys, the balloon jerseys. I've never had a grail one of those. And the last one I did, I've got Darth Vader. I do like Star Wars, but I was never really a fan of the Darth Vader jersey. So I probably won't do any jerseys. Although, is this a sign? Should I get another Jersey Mystery Lounge fly? Jersey Mystery Lounge fly? No, no. Should I get another mystery jersey box? So I wanted to really quickly show the badges so you can see what I mean where the one says Wish and the one says Cruise Line. I'm not going to lie, I'm still in a little bit of shock. 
do I keep my one that I personally bought from the cruise? Or do I keep the new one because it has the blue Mickey? What would you do? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you all so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!